So here's something I never really anticipated. I created this farm tank a while back. Um, God, I don't know, it's been a couple months now. And I bought a bunch of little crypts and divided them all and put them in these little terracotta pots. And in the bottom of each one of the terracotta pots, I put a little uh, fluval, uh, the, uh, what is it, fluval stratum. Just, just a really thin layer, just enough to block the little hole at the bottom so everything else wouldn't fall out. And on each one, I gr oh no, I ground up, I just dropped these in a bucket of water. I ground up some uh, API root tabs uh, to like a fine powder and just put a, a real fine dusting on top of the fluval stratum and then sort of suspended each crypt in the pot and packed uh, just a fine aquarium sander, you know, a medium fine aquarium sand around it. Well, I had problems with the first batch of fish I put in here, they all kicked off. And after doing water testing, you can see what's going on. In the first, originally the ammonium, or the ammonia was really high, uh, but still the nitrites and nitrates are off way too high. Uh, after reading the analysis, on the API root tabs. I'm hoping you can see that. There is a monocle nitrogen here. Ammonia is a nitrogen source, all right? And then it breaks down into nitrites and then nitrates, and you all know the, the cycle. Um, so that's the only thing I can figure why uh, why the these three parameters have been off the charts. Now, the ammonia has gotten to where it's it's okay. And the nitrates and nitrites, I know the, the nitrites will break down into nitrates with the help of the bacteria. Um, and I think it's nitrobacter. I don't remember exactly which one. Um, and it'll turn into nitrates, which are plant, essentially plant fertilizer. Uh, so it'll get used up that way. But it just blew me away that uh, there is so much uh, ammonia nitrite nitrate created in this tank and i believe it's from the api root tabs now i haven't really ever noticed i've ground uh the root tabs up and put them in the substrate in, in bigger tanks and maybe i just didn't put the same amount but i really didn't think i put that much in this tank because again i don't know there's 60 pots in here but just a light dusting and i guess all that adds up but i don't know if that's more than five root tabs um and I'm not sure what it says, how many per, per tank. Uh, directions, one tablet for each 30 square inches. Yeah, I don't know what the print or, you know, what I used up there. Um, I'd have to stop and figure that out. But I don't think I was off the top or off the charts with it. Um, but anyway, the plants are doing really well. I've got this uh, crypt spiralis in the back that's already almost to the top of the tank. These are 20-gallon uh, standards. Uh, they're doing really well. And then there, I've got Crips, I think it's Went, Went or Wenny I Bronze. Oh, shit. Um, hang on, water's overflowing. Check it out. This is what happens when you don't pay attention. Um, my wife's going to love that. So there you go. Uh, yeah, life in the fish room without paying attention. Just having too much fun recording stuff. So I have to shut this pump off. I'm using a little uh, submersible pump to make life easy to drain this thing. So anyway, talk to you all later.